on your M or LT5 affirmation, you have three angles here. But some of the angles have an X and some of the angles have a Z. You cannot solve an equation with an X and a Z at this point. They're infinite solutions. But let's look at the both angles that have an X. What's the relationship between these two? When two lines intersect, the angles form that are across from each other are called vertical angles. They're congruent. That is, this angle and this angle are congruent. That's how you can find x. So we're going to say 9x minus 20 equals 5x plus 20. Well, let's solve for x. So we're going to move the smaller x over. So let's subtract 5x from both sides. 9x minus 5x is 4x. Bring down the negative 20. 5x minus 5x, that makes 0, equals positive 20. Now the opposite of subtracting 20, we're going to add 20 to both sides. So then we get 4x, bring down the 4x, negative 20 plus 20 is 0, equals 40. Divide both sides by 4 at this point, x equals 10. Now we have to find z, but we're going to do is we're going to replace x with 10 to find the measure of these angles. 5 times 10 is 50, 50 plus 20 is 70. So this angle is 70 degrees, by the way, so is this. And what you should notice is that the angle with an x and the angle with the z are a linear pair. They add to 180 degrees. So we could say 70 plus z equals 180. Well, if we minus 70 from both sides, you get z is 110 degrees. Also on your affirmation, you had some vocabulary words that you got a little mixed up on. So let's go over these right now. Intersecting lines that form right angles. If they form a right angle, they're perpendicular. Lines that belong to the same plane and never intersect. Lines that never intersect, they're called parallel. A part of a line consisting of two endpoints and all the points between them, well, that would be a line segment. You had this one right. Belonging to the same plane, that's coplanar. When you took your quiz, it was this part you got wrong. Um, but remember, if they're all the same distance apart and they never intersect, that's parallel. Okay, at this point, I'd like you to go to MT1, LT5 and complete the redo for that and then follow the same directions as the other affirmations.